All right, tis the season for a good old-fashioned holiday movie, but there are so many new ones coming out, it's really hard to keep up. Okay, so of course, our producers made a game out of it. It's another round of Real, Real or Unreal. Unreal. And here to host is our associate producer and Gen X. What are you? Gen what? I'm millennial. Millennial. Definitely. Sean. Wait, you're a millennial and I'm a millennial? I'm. We're on opposite ends See? of the millennial spectrum. Yes. Why did you have to say it like that? <laughs> <That's> say less. <laughs> <laughs> All right, what you got, Sean? So, so here's how the game will work. I will read the name and description of a holiday movie, because okay. tis the season, and you will tell me if you think it is a real movie or an unreal movie. Okay, okay. real or okay. unreal. Okay. Movie number one, Merry Textmas. Look at me. When app designer Gabby accidentally adds Alex, a handsome graphic designer, to the family group chat, her well-meaning family decides to secretly invite him to Christmas. As they begin to play matchmaker, can the Diaz family help Gabby and Alex recognize that they're perfect for one another? Real. real. I agree, real. It is a real movie. Thank you, Lifetime Original Movie. All right. Have you watched that classic? Uh, no. <laughs> it might actually not be out yet. Okay. He's going to keep saying say less. We're going to be say quiet. less. <laughs> uh, movie number two, Slay Bells. In this RuPaul original movie, two rival gangs of drag queens are in the midst of plotting their competitive Christmas shows when a friend and local bar owner is forced to put his beloved venue up for sale. The performers put aside their differences to put on the biggest holiday drag show ever to save the local institution. I'm going to say unreal because we had RuPaul yeah, on recently. And we would have asked, asked him. We that question. We would have asked him. Yeah, you're right. It's unreal. Yeah. It's unreal. And you, and by the way, you produced that segment, so. I know, but I was thinking maybe we didn't get time. Well, say yes. Say it. less. <laughs> got it. We got it. Say less. All right. Movie number three. Three wise men and a baby. <laughs> three brothers are forced to work together to care for a baby over the holidays. While they slowly figure out how to do it, they also begin to repair their relationships with each other. And don't worry, there's plenty of romance and holiday spirit along the way. Well, the I classic, would probably watch that. Well, remember <laughs> the classic Three Men and a Baby? Yeah, yeah, Three Wise Men, that's the spin. I say yes. I True. say no. It is real, it airs tonight on Hallmark. Oh my god! Check it out. Can We're they do paid. that? Can they just take yeah. a movie, <laughs> copy it? Yeah. Hallmark can do whatever they want. That's true. All right, next movie, Forget About Christmas. <laughs> when an Italian-American superstar realizes her family is fed up with her workaholic ways, she gets help from her celebrity friends, Santa, and magical elves to give them the best Christmas ever, starring Teresa Judi Judice, Nick Cannon, Judice. and Judice, <laughs> Betty Wap, and Nick Cannon. Is it really Judice? Yes. Well, I don't know. We've done it many, many <laughs> different I ways here, tell. but she was on once. They are not, not starring real, in that not film. Real. This is a real movie. Wait, what? Airing tonight on VH1, I Know Where I Will Be. Wait. Tonight. Teresa, the Teresa table Judice flipper. is in a film? Look for an Oscar nomination for Teresa Judice <laughs> okay. for Best Supporting Act. Judice. Judice. <laughs> The Oscars will say Judy Che. Okay, next. Movie number five, Ginger, Bread, White, and Blue. When a hot shot congressman oh. unexpectedly loses his re-election bid, he sulks back to his hometown just in time for Christmas. While ignoring the festivities to plan his return to politics, a local baker reminds him to live in the moment during the holidays and cast his vote for love. Is this real or unreal? I'm going to go with, I'm going with real. I'm going with unreal. It's unreal. It's unreal. You know what? I don't know why I thought that because it could have been real. It could but, be real. But it, but it you had a feeling. Mm -hmm. Is it tied? Is it tied? All right. Now let's get okay. to the last one. Last Tiebreaker. one. It's a Hanukkah tiebreaker. Okay. Hanukkah on Rye. A matchmaker connects Molly and Jacob, but their new romance is put to the test when they realize they are competing deli owners. Can a holiday, can a Hanukkah miracle keep them together? I think that's unreal. Unreal. This is a real movie. Oh, what? Really? Where is that movie. air? It aired on Hallmark this past Sunday, the oh, first night of Hanukkah. Oh, missed it. Okay, we're tied, so what do, what do we get? You know what? You both get to star in Gingerbread, White, and Blue <laughs> when we do it next year. <laughs> Thank you, you should Sean. Write that film. Sean, excellent. Thank excellent. you, Sean. Stay last.